you know, they've denied it, but it's still hitting the share price. Right. So actually, we've seen Baidu's share price drop by as much as 10 percent in trading so far. That's the most in a year. And that's after a report in the South China Morning Post, which cited a research paper affiliated with a Chinese military university that said that they were testing their AI systems with Baidu's Ernie system. Of course, the company has come out and said they don't have a partnership or affiliation with the university um, and that as far as they're aware, this research would have been done with their publicly available uh, models. Okay, and Baidu's reaction? Well, well the denial anyway. Yes, exactly, yeah. yeah, so they are quite, um, you know, vehement that they have nothing to do with this. It's a completely unrelated type of project. Um, and so that's why we've seen them give this, this quite strongly worded statement to us and also to the SEMP. Um, I think the concern here now for analysts and traders is what's going to happen going forward. Is there this geopolitical risk overhang over Chinese AI companies like Baidu? So, I mean, is there any, are there any implications for the company's long-term plans in, uh, in the artificial intelligence arena? I think what this shows is that everyone is still very jumpy. I mean, just one report about some potential military link to Baidu can already scare the market like this. So definitely this is something we have to watch long term, whether or not there will be more risks going forward with the U.S. targeting any kind of Chinese AI that could have potential military implications.